Hi Gemini, this is Renee Michelle and you're on my channel here on YouTube, Chronicles of a Hoodoo Spiritualist. Um, welcome to all the new subscribers. Welcome to the family. We're happy to have you. Thank you for the likes, the shares, and the comments. Oh, they're greatly appreciated. Yes, yeah, so, so appreciated. Um, there's no spiritual awareness this week, but also I wanted to let you know that um, in celebration of my new website, right? Um, now until um, Sunday the 27th, um, I'll be doing the consultation, which is $25, plus the regular reading, which is $50. I'll be doing them both together for 30 right? And that's until Sunday at midnight, right? Because, Gemini, this is your weekly reading for March 20th through March 26th of Oh, my website is hoodoospiritualist.net and you can email me for the reading at hoodoospiritualist at outlook.com. The information will be down below. Gemini, what's going on beneath the surface this week, right, is the judgment card in reverse. And the judgment card upright is about you taking the time and making an assessment of the things that are going on around you, right? And it's about you um, getting rid of the things that no longer serve you, the relationships and the people that no longer serve you, that are a negative influence on your world. So... It's about taking the time out to do that. You're supposed to be in that time right now, but it's like you're, few, you're refusing to make that assessment, like you don't want to look at the issue, right? Because coming into this week, you guys feel a little confused about your emotions. Like you don't, you don't know how you truly feel about something, right? And I get this from the moon card and the queen of uh, cups, right? Because there's something going on, you know, that you don't feel sure about, that you, that you, you know, you feel like, you know, you may be getting this taken advantage of. The wool is being pulled over your eyes. You don't know how you feel about love, right? Because starting out this week, we have the Five of Cups and the Justice card, right? And I feel like some of you continue to take about, think about the past and think about past relationships and, and what you're missing in your life because that's, it makes you feel balanced. But it's unhealthy. Towards the middle of the week, right? I feel like y'all are gaining y'all strength, right? 
you're gaining your strength and you the nine of pentacles and it's 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 because i feel like you're gaining your strength because some of you know that um you you built a name for yourself as far as um because the nine of pentacles is about working from the mail room to the boardroom it's about you putting in the hard work and the dedication, you know what I'm saying, to get to the level where you are, right? And 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 it is seen so by the people around you, by the community, how you've built yourself up, whether through education or whether through just grit and grind and hard work, right? So, so you know, you're finding strength in what you've accomplished so far in your world. That's basically what it is by the middle of the week. By the end of the week, I feel like some of you have have a desire to do something that you love, right? And that's the Eight of Pentacles. The Eight of Pentacles is doing something you enjoy so much that it's not about the money, right? And the unknown card to me means that I feel like that you guys don't know what that is yet. And that's okay. Just analyze and take the time, you know, to get to know you to find out what that truly is, right? For the outcome of the week, I feel like somebody that you were supposed to be getting rid of and t remove, removing from your world, right, hurts you, right? Emperor is a good thing, but the part about him that is bad is that he's controlling and dictator. His dictatorship sometimes can be seen as harassment and as, as abusive. Nasty attitude, nasty mouth, right? And it has defeated you in some form or fashion by the end of the week. So this disillusion about love at the beginning of the week, guys, you got to watch out. Protect your heart, Gemini. Protect your heart. Stay blessed, Ashe. Love you. See you next week.